Hi guys, this is Larissa with Be You Beautiful One. Welcome to my channel. I'm so glad that you're here. I'm setting up in my horizontal planner for the week of November the 9th through the 15th. And I will be using these happy planner books, the Wow Style Happy Planner sticker book and the Happy Memory Keeping book. In addition to that, I'm going to be using my Disney Happy Planner sticker books, the Bot sticker books, and the Mini sticker book. So I'm so excited to use all of these items together. In addition to that, I do have some pumpkins that I cut out that have like the leopard print on them. And I thought they were really cute and they fit some of the personality of the mini mouse stickers that are in the sticker book so i thought that would be cute to bring all of these items together you, of course wild style has some um leopard print as well too so i wanted to use all of these elements together so first i'm starting off in the notes section of the horizontal planner spread um this is where i usually like to put my uh, focal decorative piece at and I started off by using a rose gold foil box from the Wow Style sticker book. Um, I am going to be mixing metals in this layout. I'll be going back and forth between gold and rose gold. So yes, I did. I did. I did. And I put several of the pumpkins that I cut out down below in different sizes. And then I put some of the leaves um, that were in the memory planning book around it. And then I uh, love this Pickaboo Minnie Mouse that I put on the right hand side of the pumpkin. I thought that was really cute. And then the other Mickey is like sort of dancing and saying, yay, yay. So I thought that was really cute. Love how that turned out and felt like it would um, give me a good start into the remainder of the layout. So I have to say, using my Disney stickers was really hard. And this is my first spread using my Disney stickers, okay? Um, <laughs> I am glad that I was able to get a duplicate of this book because I, I probably would have had even harder of a time using these stickers because they're so cute and they have like the rose gold foiling on them. Oh my God, these stickers are so adorable. And you know, I love pink and rose gold. So I started off with using one of the boxes in the colorful box sticker book along with this Minnie Mouse head. And it says, you can do anything. So I thought this was a really good um, sticker to put on the start of the week. You can do anything, right? And so I love that. And now I'm looking through um, the mini sticker book for like something to layer on top of, of the box sticker. And so I decided to go with today and mini is sort of peeking out. So today you can do anything. I love how that turned out. Um, I was going to utilize some of these tasseless stickers, but I really couldn't figure out what I really wanted to do with the task stickers. Um, I am probably, I am going to change my mind on the tasseless stickers towards the end of the spread and you'll see that happen um, later on. Otherwise, these tasseless stickers were really cute. I just wasn't feeling the tasseless stickers because um, I'm starting to find with my horizontal layout, I like to do like a overall view of what my week is going to look like. And sometimes having those tasseless stickers um, makes me feel like I don't have enough in my 
weekly plans so <laughs> i decided to remove those towards the end i prefer to use dots though because dots i can control like how many lines i want to add to my um planner and then um at a later time if i don't need them i can remove them or i can um add to them as uh, add to the dots as well so I really like having that flexibility and then on Tuesday I put down a, a, a box sticker and I layered it with this cute mini it's she's just in your face cute and I love that and uh, for Wednesday I put down another bot sticker with a graph in there but I didn't use the graph and the the quote sticker that I got from the Wow Style book says, fill your heart with what's most important and forget the rest. So I like that saying. Then we have Minnie sort of, you know, doing a little flirty pose. It sort of looks like she's leaning on the box. So I like that. And then I wanted to pull back in some of the pumpkins because I really did forget about the pumpkins at this point. And so I decided to put some pumpkins down at the bottom so that I could continue to tie in the fall theme with the pumpkins. And I put down some leaves surrounding the pumpkins. So I like that. And up at the top, I put all I see is magic. I love that sticker. And then at the bottom, I put this peekaboo kind of um, sticker with mini in it and it already came in the box so that was really cute and I was trying to coordinate what my placement would be for the right hand side of the page and so I started off with utilizing some stickers from the wow style book and that sticker quote sticker for Friday says elegance never goes out of style which is so true. <laughs> and then I popped another mini down. And I love the minis with the rose gold foil bows. I think that's so cute. I think it's a very um, elegant way of including the, the rose gold foil without it being in your face by having the rest of mini in black and white. So I thought that was really cool. And I put down this Hello Weekend sticker. And again, I wanted to make for sure I incorporated some of these pumpkins that I took so much time out to size and cut down and cut out. So I thought that was really cute. And um, to create some different levels of the pumpkins, um, I just sliced a portion of the pumpkin off so that I have the layers of of height um, sometimes I was able to achieve that which is using the three sizes that I have but other times I needed more dramatic um, effect in the layering or the levels of the pumpkins so I would just cut the pumpkins off to create that so that I would have more room in the the different rows to write out my plans and so going back over to the left hand side i felt like i needed another pumpkin to still um point out that this is a false spread so i decided to cut a pumpkin in half and layer that underneath the mini for tuesday and i could have left the box in um, the full size but um, I didn't want to risk pulling up the whole entire sticker and and making it um, look warp or whatever. So and two, sometimes the stickers can show through the other stickers and I wanted to minimize that. So I felt like cutting that sticker in half before layering it underneath mini would be the best thing going back over to the right side i used a quote sticker from the disney book it says choose joy and it already has leopard in there so something really simple on top of a colorful box sticker with a mini on top of it and i decided not to use a rose gold foil bow mini mouse i just used the plain pink bow because i already have two mini mouses with the rose gold bow in the next row down and i just didn't want it to be overload so 
I like that. Now I removed that circle sticker up at the top that all I see is magic and I'm gonna save that for later. I add this small bar, dear dream, do repeat up at the top um, just so that um, I didn't have to worry about fidgeting anymore with um, a sticker being on top of the right hand side page so i wanted to have some balance but i wanted there to be a statement piece as well and then i just took some of the remaining um, leaves that i had in my memory keeping book and i just put those around the corner i sliced them in half and just put them around the edge and i also did that on the left hand side of the page i struggled a little bit more on the left hand side of the page because i already had put down um, that dare dream do repeat sticker and i didn't want to continue to lift that up because it was tearing the page so i decided to call it for the day popped in one of those green leaf stickers and was done so i really enjoyed how this layout um turned out i thought it was fun it was festive and it also is reflected of the season of the fall season with all the different pumpkins and as i stated last week i am falling in love with pumpkins um i'm trying to figure out how i could continue pumpkins throughout the rest of the month uh, <laughs> as much as possible so <laughs> yeah i really enjoyed this let me know what you think about this spread and i will um post the link down where I got the digital pumpkin side in case you want to use those in your spread this year or next year. Thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on your notification bell, and until the next time, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.